Hi, it's Valentine's Day. Shout Wolf Bark here. I'm here to talk about the most important part about Valentine's Day. Love. I love my family. I love my friends. I love my subscribers. And love by Fedwood. Before we talk about love, we need to understand. And it's not about all the jokes, so anyways, love is a retro style platformer. It is Die is Retro Heart, but it's nice that you can put down checkpoints at any time. That when I first played the game, I didn't know. I just got through these long levels with no idea of the checkpoints since I just using the two buttons. But when I discovered that, that's nice. It also gives a respawn button if they kill you if you need that. So that I kind of press like X. I don't ask it on my controller. <laughs> well, like, the 8-bit style is kind of overdone, but it pops out with an interesting use of black and white and the radiant colors for the levels. And the character, and the character is really surprisingly dynamic. Like, the dude looks like he's actually running, he does flip and stuff. Like, it's surprisingly cute. He, he kind of looks like the fire, the fire, um, symbol for... Kind of look like the fi Japanese fire sign. Love is great if you're looking for a ch looking for a fun challenge, especially if it's type of Mario Maker's 2 BS. I think the level looks really cool. It, it looks like a death factory with a dragon course in the middle of it. It's a short game. The main mode goes go through si the 16 levels with 100 lives. It'd be great. It's great about how. How high fast it did, how many checkpoints you used, etc. etc. And there's easy mode. It's the same level, but you got unlimited lives with no grade. And there's yellow mode. That's yellow mode. <laughs> and there's speed run mode. It's all about the times. Lives don't matter. In this weird though, there's there's six other levels that are super hard, and I don't remember this. I think they added it later. If you, if they're looking for a great challenge, it's really hard not to recommend, especially when this game's three to five bucks. And the music is really, really great. Most, most of it's just by like, techno that really, really gets you in the mood to go through these obstacles. But this is one really cool. My favorite track called Kid Side B. Or, I think it's just called Kid. I can listen for hours and then it's the trailing music. It helps me focus during the level when you do play. It's hard to follow some good good line, line on top. Oh and all, if you need a go you need a good platformer with a fan challenge that would best your time with modern conveniences, this is the place to go. And if you want more from love, this Kuso, the sequel to this game. And the they often bundle again super cheap. And it, Love A Kuso came to the Switch last year. And Love and Kuso are a great deal together. And if you don't mind, I got a date.